Hello, my crafty friends, and welcome back to another month of our crafty goals with Amaya. She started this two years ago. She did it on her own, and then she invited others to join her, and we are continuing this year, and we are inviting everybody. So let me show you what I've done for February and give you a glimpse of what I have coming up the rest of this month. Okay, here's my February calendar. I'm using my Christian planner. And my general goals are to do the So You Only Have 10 Minutes series. That's where I take 10 minute increments. I use my little timer and create the cards from Alicia's card sketch. Call me Crafty Al. She does a card sketch every month. And then my goals video in 10 on the 10th collaboration. And then the embellishments on the 11th. Then every other month I have the um, Club EP subscription. So I show that. And let, so let's go on and show you the cards that I've made. This was from the sketch. February 2021 from Alicia and I did use the Echo Park collection winter market and I'll be doing that every other month because I get the kit around the 27th and then I'm going to use it to highlight the show us your sheet load. Okay so that's for the show us your sheet load. So you only have 10 minutes. And then, of course, the crafty goals. And so for the 10 on the 10th, I did the uh, the rest of the Martha Stewart collection. I have a box, 12 by 12 box of my Christmas scraps. And so what I'm doing is I'm just going down the row. Whatever is there is what I use. And I'm just slowly going through that. So I had some bits and pieces left from that collection. So this is the polar bear one. Everybody seems to like the polar bear. And another one I did was the quilt card. This is the first time I've used this. This is from My Favorite Things, and this is the original. They have another one now that is supposed to be easier to get the pieces out. <laughs> so I had a fun time with that. But that seemed to be everybody's favorite also. And then embellishments on the 11th. This is my first watercolor project since I started paper crafting. And so I wanted to do that. The tulips, of course, is a stamp. And then I just used my watercolors. And I also have some metallics. I don't know if you can see that. I used a large postage stamp die to cut this piece, and then I just stamped Happy Easter on it. So when I do the embellishments on the 11th, then the following Saturday or whatever day it falls on, um, I go ahead and make cards with those embellishments. So there's the card I made with, with this. I cut it down, I went ahead and painted it, then I cut it down. So this is not distressing. This is watercolor. And then I did um, how-to on embossing folders on the 17th. And then I did a how-to on heat embossing. But after a few days, that was obvious that it wasn't doing too well. And I checked my analytics, and sure enough, um, I think people got turned off because I tried to talk quietly, and it just didn't sound very well at all. So I went ahead and reshot that for the tw for the 27th. So I that published on the 27th. So then I did the rest of the kit. That's what I call it, and I finished up some more winter market so all I have is just a few scraps left I used the fun fold card sketch 
from Call Me Crafty Owl, October 2019. This is one of my favorite fun folds. And then my homemade gatefold card, Snow. And this is Mint Macaron. It matches really well. And a couple of stickers from the collection. Okay, so that that pretty much ends that month. Here's March. Everything's in still in pencil. I got the March 2021 printable. And I worked on the cards for that. Did my 10 minute series. And here we are, Crafty Goals. 10 on the 10th, I haven't, I have got that started. It is uh, leftover paper from an old Stampin' Up! Uh, designer series paper set and then embellishments on the 11th I will probably do something St. Patrick's Day and then I will be making cards from those embellishments and then I'll I will go ahead and post 17th the 20th 24th and 27th I will be getting Echo Park so we will do something with that probably the next month. But so far, that is what I'm going to pretty much stick to my goals. Using up all my scraps, the Christmas scraps for 10 on the 10th. And doing my Echo Park. I will do two videos a month from that. Or two sets of videos. I will be... Every other month, I'll be doing the uh, show us your sheet load. And then I will do the rest of the kit to show you some more cards from that set. Looking forward to the rest of this month. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.